This UNESCO World Heritage Site in England is home to Scorfell Pike, its highest mountain. Can you name it? Is it Lake District, River District, Water District, or Bike District? The Lake District, one of the most beautiful regions of the United Kingdom, is located in the heart of Cumbria, a predominantly rural county in the far northwest of England. World famous for its beautiful lakes and mountainous fells, carved out long ago by glaciers, the Lake District today is a playground for walkers and outdoor enthusiasts. The Lake District, also known as the Lakes or Lakeland, and now a UNESCO World Heritage Site, is home to Scorfell Pike, its highest mountain and washed water its deepest lake and thriving communities like Keswick and Bonus on Windermere. Can you identify this landmark which is also the largest angel sculpture in the world? Is it, Flying Angel, the Lone Angel, Angel of the North, or the Redeemer? The Angel of the North is as much a part of Gateshead's identity as the Statue of Liberty is to New York. Since it first spread its wings in February 1998, it has become one of the most talked about and recognizable pieces of public art ever produced. With its prime location, on a panoramic hilltop by the A1, the Angel of the North has become one of the most famous artworks in the region. Sculpture is 54 meter wide, 20 meter high and weighs 200 tons. Can you name the world's eighth largest suspension bridge, located in United Kingdom, with a span of 1,410 meters? Is it, Humber Bridge, London Bridge, Tyne Bridge, or Forth Bridge? Humber Bridge is the world's eighth largest suspension bridge with a span of 1,410 meters. It is located between the towns of Barton upon Humber in Lincolnshire and Hessel East Riding of Yorkshire in England. The bridge has dual roadways in both directions and pedestrian path on both sides. Humber Bridge is 2,220 meters long and the largest span is 1,410 meters. The bridge crosses the Humber estuary between Hessel, East Yorkshire and Barton upon Humber, North Lincolnshire. Can you name the first national public museum of the world, which is located in London, England? Is it, the Empire Museum, the British Museum, the King's Museum, or Tate Modern? The British Museum was founded in 1753 and opened its doors in 1759. It was the first national museum to cover all fields of human knowledge, open to visitors from across the world. The British Museum is unique in bringing together under one roof, the cultures of the world, spanning continents and oceans. The collection, including world-famous objects such as the Rosetta Stone, the Parthenon sculptures, and Egyptian mummies. This museum has a unique collection of more than 80 million specimens and also includes one of the world's most impressive dinosaur exhibitions. Can you name it? Is it, the Animal Planet, the Wild Museum, the King's Museum, or Natural History Museum? The Natural History Museum is one of the most iconic and impressive buildings in London. Discover star specimens such as Hope, a 25-meter blue whale plunging down from the ceiling, a rock as old as the solar system and one of the UK's most complete dinosaurs. 
Other treasures from the museum's unique collection of more than 80 million specimens can be seen across its many permanent galleries, which includes one of the world's most impressive dinosaur exhibitions. Can you identify this landmark of a famous admiral? Is it the Admiral Monument, Keppel Column, Admiral Billa, or Nelson Column? The iconic monument was built to commemorate British naval hero Admiral Horatio Nelson, who died at the Battle of Trafalgar in 1805. The monument, built between 1840 and 1843, is built of the Corinthian order, a style of ancient Greek and Roman architecture. It is characterized by slender fluted columns and elaborate capitals, which are decorated with acanthus leaves and scrolls. The four bronze lions which sit at the base of Nelson's column were added in 1867 almost 25 years after the monument was erected. Which UK landmark is famous for its heather-clad moorland? Is it, North Yorkshire Moors, Bodmin Moor, Schwarzes Moor, or Dartmoor? The North York Moors is a special place, forged by nature, shaped over generations. The National Park Authority works with a huge variety of people to care for this beautiful corner of Yorkshire. Picturesque, tranquil, wonderful, the North York Moors are a breath of fresh air. Comprising over 1,400 miles of natural beauty, this enchanting region is home to heather moorland, pine forests, rolling hills and shimmering coastline, not to mention badgers, roe deer and hawks. One of the many right-of-way footpaths which cut across heather-coated heathland, ridges and North Sea cliff edges in the North York Moors. Can you name this landmark, famous for the man-made broads? Is it the Yorkshire Broads, London Broads, Lancashire Broads, or the Norfolk Broads? Norfolk is possibly most famous for the man-made broads, a national park with over 125 miles of navigable lock-free waterways set in beautiful countryside and studded with charming and picturesque towns and villages. The Norfolk broads landscape is one of beauty and peace, of water, marsh, woodland and wide skies, with views of church towers and windmills. There is abundant wildlife including many rare butterflies and dragonflies. Name the waterfront located in Liverpool which is listed as an UNESCO World Heritage Site. Is it Sandon Dock, Salthouse Dock, Royal Albert Dock, or Cardiff Dock? Located on Liverpool's UNESCO World Heritage Waterfront. Royal Albert Dock Liverpool is the most visited free tourist destination in northwest England, home to world-class museums, galleries, restaurants, bars and shops. Iconic in style, immense in ambition. Liverpool's docks dominated global trade in the 19th century, with the Albert Dock at their heart. To this day the Mersey continues to play a central role in the city's cultural life, with the dock an integral part of our World Heritage Waterfront. Name the world's leading museum of art and design, housing a permanent collection of over 2.3 million objects that span over 5,000 years of human creativity. Is it, Victoria and Albert Museum, British Museum, World Museum, or Royal Museum? The Victoria and Albert Museum is the world's leading museum of art and design, housing a permanent collection of over 2.3 million objects that span over 5,000 years of human creativity. The museum holds many of the UK's national collections and houses some of the greatest resources for the study of architecture, furniture, fashion, textiles, photography, sculpture, 
painting, jewelry, glass, ceramics, book arts, Asian art and design, theatre and performance. Name the park which was created by an unique act of parliament as a green lung for London, Essex and Hertfordshire. Is it, Richmond Park, Greenwich Park, Lee Valley Regional Park, or Hampden Park? Lee Valley Regional Park Authority runs award-winning open spaces and sports venues along the 26-mile-long, 10,000-acre park. The park was created by a unique Act of Parliament as a green lung for London, Essex, and Hertfordshire. Lee Valley Park approach is to be community-focused and commercially driven, to work with partners to produce a unique combination of activities, sites and experiences. What is London Eye? Is it? A spy camera on London Tower, clock tower, a satellite, or observation wheel. At 135 metres, the London Eye is the world's largest cantilevered observation wheel. The London Eye is located on the south bank of the River Thames. It was conceived and designed by Mark Sparfield Architects and was launched in 2000. It has won over 85 awards for national and international tourism, outstanding architectural quality and engineering achievement. William the Conqueror, built this famous tower where you can see the crown jewels. Can you name it? Is it, Spinnaker Tower, Blackpool Tower, St. Stephen's Tower? or Tower of London. One of the world's most famous fortresses, the Tower of London has seen service as a royal palace, prison, armory and even a zoo. Today, it's a World Heritage Site, where you'll be dazzled by the crown jewels and hear tales from the tower on tours given by the Yeoman Warders. 1,000 years of history are packed into this intriguing London Tower, built by William the Conqueror in the 11th century. The White Tower, the iconic castle keep, houses the Royal Armouries collections, including the 350-year-old exhibition line of kings and striking royal armours worn by Henry VIII, Charles I and James II. Which is the oldest and largest occupied castle in the world? Is it Stirling Castle? Windsor Castle, Dover Castle, or Edinburgh Castle. A royal home and fortress for over 900 years, Windsor Castle, the largest occupied castle in the world, remains a working palace today. Founded by William the Conqueror in the 11th century, it has since been the home of 39 monarchs. The Queen uses the castle both as a private home, where she usually spends the weekend, and as an official royal residence at which she undertakes certain formal duties. How many stones are there at the Stonehenge located at Wiltshire, England? Is it 100, 50, 1000, or 75? Stonehenge, located in Wiltshire, England, is a prehistoric monument comprising of roughly 100 massive upright stones placed in a circular layout. It was built in several stages. The first monument was an early Henge monument, built about 5,000 years ago, and the unique stone circle was erected in the late Neolithic period about 2500 BC. In the early Bronze Age many burial mounds were built nearby. Today, together with Avebury, Stonehenge forms the heart of a World Heritage Site, with a unique concentration of prehistoric monuments. Elizabeth Tower, earlier called as St. Stephen's Tower is famous for Big Bun, Big Ben, Big Buck, or Big Bob.
Big Ben is the nickname for the great bell of the striking clock at the north end of the Palace of Westminster in London and is usually extended to refer to both the clock and the clock tower. The official name of the tower, however, has been Elizabeth Tower, ever since it was renamed in 2012 as part of the Diamond Jubilee celebrations for Queen Elizabeth II. Which is the largest theme park in the United Kingdom? Is it, Alton Towers Theme Park? Drayton Manor Theme Park, Magic Kingdom Theme Park, or Flamingo Land Theme Park. Orton Towers is the largest theme park in the UK, spanning 910 acres of land in central Staffordshire. Orton Towers Resort has been a world-renowned haven of fun and adventure for almost 200 years. Inspired by Disneyland, the modern park was designed to be home to multiple, otherworldly spaces, grounded in English heritage. The theme park opening at Alton Towers included the Corkscrew, Britain's first double-loop roller coaster, plus the pirate ship, Cine 2000 and the Wildlife Museum. Which is the only zoo in the whole of United Kingdom which is home to giant pandas? Is it, Chester Zoo, London Zoo, Edinburgh Zoo, or Marwell Zoo? Edinburgh Zoo is owned by the Royal Zoological Society of Scotland. The society was founded in March 1909, and the zoo opened in July 1913. Set in 82 acres of sloping parkland, the zoo is situated three miles to the west of Edinburgh city centre. Home to over 1,000 rare and endangered animals, including the UK's only giant pandas. RZSS Edinburgh Zoo is packed with fun and unzoosial things to do. Explore the famous penguin parade and visit the world's only knighted penguin, Sir Nils Olav. Which water landmark is famous for a large monster which has captured the imagination of the world? Is it, Ghost Shark, Dragon Lake, Giant Otter, or Loch Ness? Loch Ness located near Inverness is shrouded in mystery. Tales of a large monster living deep beneath the dark expanses of Loch Ness have circulated the world since the first photograph emerged in 1933. With over 1,000 eyewitness accounts, sightings and unexplained evidence, scientists continued to be baffled by the existence of Nessie. Explore with a boat trip and Nessie cruise from Inverness, Fort Augustus, and Drumna Drukit. The Highlands is world famous for its dramatic scenery great adventure sports and nearby castles and solitary lighthouses dotting the landscape. This 128 acres zoological garden and home to over 35,000 animals is the most visited zoo in the United Kingdom. Can you name it? Is it, Chester Zoo, London Zoo, Edinburgh Zoo, or Marwell Zoo? Chester Zoo is a zoological garden in Upton by Chester, in Cheshire, England. The North of England Zoological Society is the organization that runs Chester Zoo and our conservation campaign, Act for Wildlife. It was opened in 1931 by George Mottershead and his family, who used as a basis some animals reported to have come from an earlier zoo in Shavington. There's over 35,000 animals and 128 acres of zoological gardens to explore. Wander around the amazing animal exhibits including the Realm of the Red Ape, Savo Black Rhino Reserve, the impressive Asian Elephant House, Fruit Bat Forest and the newly opened islands at Chester Zoo.